Hey, I just wanted to give you a little tip about day nine. Okay, so I know that some of you are asking, you know, what about people that you know that can't change? You're, you're, you're convinced that they'll never change. They're locked into who they are, you know, and what if they'll never change? There's nothing you can do. You know, you've been working for years. You have people that are in your life that you just absolutely know they're never going to change in a frustrating situation or a situation that you're frustrated with and you're just convinced, your mind is convinced. So if it's really not something that you're frustrated with in being frustrated, it's never going to change, you'll open. And it doesn't feel bad. It's just a calm, discerning sense of knowing something that you're frustrated with is truly not capable of having a change. It will open you when you think this is never going to change. And in that, there's a difference. When, when bad news is, news is delivered, I could say one of the ways to use this that we talk about in the stress to happiness is how to clear out other people's opinions of you. Some, other, some opinions that are not positive open you. It's true. It's something you really need to work on. And other, another opinion that someone has of you that they say to you, you're too controlling or you're too this, will close you. When you think, am I too controlling? You'll close because it's not true. It's their garbage they're putting on you. But there are times, definitely, this is one of the gifts of your IGS, when you'll think, am I too controlling? And you'll open. And you'll be like, oh, I am. I'm being controlling. I'm being in this way, right? One time my husband accused me of being manipulative. And I said, I am not manipulative. And I can say that, manipulative. And I closed. And I was like, oh, I closed. I just closed. I said, I am being manipulative. And I opened. Now, let me explain. Manipulative sounds like a really bad word, but what he, I said, okay, well, I, I, I am being manipulative. What do you mean? And he said, your, your enthusiasm, your enthusiasm is the problem, Zen. You, you want me to do this. And so you're trying to talk me into it and you're not giving me the opportunity to decide for myself what's right. And if you're too enthusiastic, then I'm afraid I'm going to hurt your feelings or you're going to be disappointed in me. So I will decide something that's not right for me because I want you to be happy. And that's not fair. And he's right. It's not fair. I want him to make his own decisions. I want him to be empowered in our relationship. I don't want to make him feel like I'm influencing him or I'm emotionally going to affect, you know, my emotions are going to affect his decisions. So here's the thing I'm saying. Bad news, when it's true, opens you. And what happens is, is you feel that centered, like when in your listening practice, that, that open centeredness. You can handle bad news. You can handle problems when they come up because you're open. Part of the four questions that go after, is this any of my business? It walks you through. They were originally meant for crisis situation in work situations. Okay. I started this in a, I built a million, multi-million dollar business following my internal guidance system. And in crisis situations, I use my IGS and I go through the four powerful questions for myself because that gets me to right action and I'm centered, open and ready to move forward. Some people think, oh, I can see how this would work for personal stuff, but it doesn't work for business. I work with corporations. I work with business executives. This is powerful leadership information. This works in every aspect of your life. Every aspect, professional, personal, with children, with everybody. So this is amazing. So my point is this, but if is, is that if you feel that the situation will not change and it closes you, you are wrong. Your mind, not you, your big, divine, gorgeous, juicy, fabulous self that I love, but your mind is wrong. It's, it's not true. And, and there is a solution and it's up to you in your grand, beautiful, bigger, wiser beingness to find it, to get that frustration out of your life because the frustration is resistance. And in that resistance, the good stuff's not coming to you either. So it's your job to clear this stuff out of your life. You're in charge of your internal experience and whether you're getting what you want or not in life and it's able to get to you and whether you're in the state of allowing and you're open is all based on you figuring this out. So if you're frustrated, don't blame anybody else. If you're closed, you've got to figure out how to get yourself open. That's part of your purpose. Unless you say it's, it's any of my business and then it's not. And then just let it go and get rid of the frustration that way. <laughs> Anyways, I love you guys. Thanks for listening to me. I'm a little passionate about this stuff. I do believe it will change the planet. And um, that this is the work we all need to be doing. Taking self-responsibility and changing it from the inside out with power. 
and getting into our openings so that openings beget openings. And in dealing with others, our opening will beget openings, we'll get openings, and we'll find the solutions that we need. Frustration's a hard one. It's, seen, it's very convincing. So I appreciate you and I applaud you for doing your best to figure it out. It takes time. If you have the opportunity and the resources to do the stress to happiness makeover program, do, because it changes everything. You go way deeper and it locks this stuff in. Just join. All right. And you get more time with me, more one-on-one -on -one group coaching, coaching and one-on-one -on -one forums. So anyways, have a great day. We're on to day 10 tomorrow. We're almost done. We're almost done. Three more days. Sending you love and blessings. Bye. Thank you so much for doing the Recreating You game. I hope you're having extraordinary ahas already. People have from day one. And so no matter where you are in the game, there's amazing things that you're learning about yourself and the power that lies within you. If you would like to have your questions answered, please put them in the comments below. We do our best to get back to comments or so does our, our members <laughs> and our students. They love to go ahead and, and support people in learning to use their IGS. You are welcome to email us at support at smartsoul.com to get more deeply into the programs, or you can go to smartsoulacademy.com if you already know you want to jump in and learn how to master this extraordinary thing that you were born with, your internal guidance system. There you'll find 16 programs that lead you through all areas of your life and weekly group coaching with me so that we can work on your specific issues and supporting you and getting aligned with your purpose, your prosperity, and peace. That's smartsoulacademy.com, and it's all available to you for $25 a month. I know, amazing. You can afford this less than Starbucks each week. Come check it out. SmartSoulAcademy.com.